We should be doing work, but instead we're playing video games. Hey there everybody, this is Brian from GXP Gaming, and welcome back to Detective Grimoire. This is the fourth video in the series, which means at the end of this one, I will be stopping the series unless you guys leave a comment in the place below. Let me know you want to see more of this, because I actually am enjoying this game. They're all sassy, fun characters. And even though I know it's a point-and-click adventure game, there's a lot of talking, and stuff like that, there's also puzzles for me to solve. Like, I want to do this with you guys, it's going to be so much fun. But, that said, you guys got to let me know in the description below if you want to see me do more, and I'll be, like, making sure to remind you at the end of the video. That said, let's get back into it. We just met Sally, the pretty girl there who was in charge of that, so she just said we don't see her... I wasn't here yesterday, so... Let's be sassy! Did you, Did miss, you miss me? me? You're the detective, right? I'm a Well, that's a... So, that's your pose. That was your head I saw looking through here. <laughs> mm, oh. <laughs> you spotted it too. If you're good at your job, you may have realized that it's kind of dead around here. So, I generally notice magical floating detective hats. <laughs> Fair enough. Don't worry. You'll better about it. How do you know? Oh, I have a good imagination. Ah. He's cute. I like her. She's always... She's also very posy. I didn't expect to see like, someone your age working in a place like this. But then again, I didn't expect there to be a place like this in a place like this. Yeah. I only started working here this year anyway. It's time. Just huh. running the gift shop to earn a little extra money. Don't ask how I ended up here. I'll save that question for you. Oh, wait. You don't seem at home here. Mm. Exactly. I hate it. This place huh. is disgusting. Come on. Okay. You don't think it's kind of beautiful? Not really. You would say that. You only just got Why would here. I? Okay, fair I'm enough. If I wasn't here, I'd be stuck in my office doing paperwork. At least to your office, you don't have to bring spare clothes every day. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Place without being covered in dirt. Challenge accepted. Dude, I like her. She poses a lot. She's probably the bad guy. I need to ask you about last night. I know, but it won't help. I worked here during the day, then left my gift shop and went home in the evening. Okay. Every day. You just leave your gift shop here when you go? No, Why not? I put it in my pocket. Yeah, seriously though. She as says as she shows off her backside. I think I'd get in trouble if I wrote something like that. Down uh. the well, look, you've noticed the gift shop has wheels, and you're thinking, oh, she's pretty lazy to leave it lying around. But not if really. you want to try pushing this thing hmm. through the swamp, be my guess. That's fair. And I can't knock it up. So no, just that's true. Oh, okay. Nobody's ever stolen any of this lousy merchandise anyway. I even left That's my fair. spare clothes here back home last night. Huh. You left That's a good thing to know. By the gift shop. Yeah, it's no big deal. They were all still here this morning. Hmm. Kind of. Kind of? Kind of? I think someone played a stupid joke, and my spare okay. black leggings were covered in some disgusting swamp slime when I found them in the bag this morning. Ew. If you're going to take my clothes and mess them up, then just keep them. I don't want them back. You know what I mean? I uh, absolutely do. Yeah, we're not going to do that to your leggings. Don't worry. Like, like leggings, like Sully says, someone played a joke on her. Strange liquid slimes. I left all these leggings in her bag and left the bag in the last night. Okay. Talk about the buggy costume. Theory, the murderer was wearing a costume. A homemade outfit designed <laughs> to look like the swamp creature. Mm. I've never seen anything so ridiculous. You've never seen me in that. I know it's not exactly the latest fashion, but... No, you've never seen me in that. It would cover huh. me up entirely. That's... that's the point that's of the true. Yeah. Look, detective. When you have legs like mine, you don't want to be wearing disguises. Is that why you always wear those black leggings? Hmm. You've only just met me and you're making assumptions about what I always wear. And hmm. making assumptions is the fun part of being a detective. I have to admit, she does have nice legs. <laughs> I always wear these. Okay. Uh, present it, Blue. Uh, folders file, no. No black leggings. They're ah! mine, but I left them here last night. Now, they're covered in slime, Ooh. and I don't want to go near them. That's fair. Okay, so, nothing I can really talk about. We're gonna have to do, like, clues and profiles eventually, so... Okay. That Hit is piece. not something from my gift shop. Thank you. I've never seen it before. How about profiles? Uh, let's go with... 
Harper. I really don't know what to tell you. Okay, fine. Profile. Uh, is that one of the other suspects? They're more yep. suspicious than me. Let's agree on that. Fair enough. Uh, Mr. I'm Remington. I'm sure I was got paid, <clears throat> so I can't say anything bad about him. You can okay. if you like. He won't hear you. <laughs> more respect for the dead. I know. Uh. <laughs> I know. I like her. She's fun. I'm still pretty sure she's probably going to turn out to be the villain or something. Okay, so where can I go? There we go. Let's go outside the office. We have a key, right? So let's use it. Even though I have the key, this might not be as simple as I'd hoped. Oh my, why not? This door has two keyholes. Oh. Huh. So... Which key should I use in each one? Oh, great. Um, you... What the? Oh, No real hints for this one, huh? Okay. Wait, 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 Process of elimination. Oh. Certain it has to do with something with this. Um, sorry. This one? Oh. 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 Hey, I got nothing for now. Okay, great. <laughs> have to do some more digging. I okay, talked to these two fools already and got a lot out of them. Let's talk to me more about the Boggy I costume. These designs for a costume, <laughs> a Boggy <clears throat> costume. Uh huh. The legendary swamp creature. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. But these are just a child's drawings, are they not? You think? No. Hmm. Perhaps. It's difficult to tell. Hmm. You're not helpful. How about you? <laughs> what can you tell me about these designs for a Boggy costume? Nothing yes. whatsoever. You're sure you didn't see anything like this while you were filming yesterday? Wait, oh. hold on a minute. What if you- Don't you dare ask. <laughs> this costume isn't your doing, is it? Made for your movie, I mean? My friend, there will be no costumed idiots within the viewfinder of my camera. I can assure you that. Oh, What about sassy. your movie? Isn't that gonna be, like, a guy in a costume or, or a puppet or, or one of those weird robot things? Technology has been kind to people like me. We no longer have so? any need for such tomfoolery. Oh, you're I gonna can CGI a it. perfectly believable swamp creature within the confines of a computer. Great. Much cheaper, too. <laughs> you look awful. Never strictly go with just CGI. And treehouse. <laughs> the tree comes... It even has little hmm. drawers carved into it. Okay, even all... Nice. That's pretty cool. Uh, that is pretty cool. I'm in door. Hey! I found these designs for a boggy costume. Do you know anything about them? You're <clears> asking <throat> me because you can tell I'm experienced with needlecraft and sew my own clothes? No. Sure. But that's a good reason. Let's go with that. Well, All right. these designs look like they should have stayed where they were. In Oof. the trash? On paper. Oh, uh, uh, how come? Whoever drew them didn't really know what they were doing. You okay. would have done it differently? Of course. I am a seamstress. Huh. There was a time when I considered sewing my craft. I lied All right. about it. Ah. Really? When Richard Remington arrived in the swamp years ago, I mm -hmm. offered him some of my handmade fabric as a peace offering. Okay. I don't think he cared much for it. Most likely he threw it away. A pointless gift from some strange woman. Alrighty. You can put that away. Okay, uh, present clue. Uh, Let's see. Clothes. First, and t we already did this. We already did this. Crap. Fine, whatever. Can't go back out apparently. And now, eh, eh. My bad. I used the wrong one. I used the wrong one. Clue. This tripping sucker. 
first thing we do is put in tap. And now... I want to do this and this again. And bam! Yeah, it's the same! Now Woo. I know what that liquid consists of. I'll wipe it down. Yeah. Ah, cool. That looks pretty similar to last time. Yes, it does. Blue. This one's also gooey. Let's see. First thing we do, then tap the faucet. Womp okay. juice. Blurp. Hey, why do I got the feeling this is going to be the exact have... same thing? Blurp. 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 Ding, 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 ding. Now I know what that liquid consists of. I'll write it down in my notes. Hmm. Huh. Was that the same as last time? This yes, was. was the exact same liquid. Yup. I don't even know where the swamp juice came from. Cool. Blue. Doesn't help much at all. Great. Back. But I got that done. That's the important thing. Okay, so maybe the woods. Check that again. Hey, girl. Aha! The great detective returns. Did yes. you run out of ideas? <clears throat> maybe a little bit. Push in the right direction. Sure. And I was ignoring you when you push me, but the direction would help. You know, it needs a little push. No need to push me. But the direction would help. Mm -hmm. Like it or not, I'm here to help you. I guess Yay. you give me a map, then you magically disappear and hide behind a tree for an hour. You want me uh. to be impressed? Did you talk to all the suspects yet? Not yet. I'm working on it. You Where's can't the last rush suspect? These things, you know? Have you noticed hmm. anything unusual? I notice that this is going yeah. to take longer than I originally planned, and I have yeah. a feeling that I wasn't wrong about this tourist attraction. What do you mean? Hmm. I had a hard time believing there could be a place like this here in the dark corner of the swamp. Mm. It didn't make sense, and it still doesn't. Some things mm. don't make sense straight away. You need to look a little closer. At what? The mud? At everything. The water? The trees? The no. bananas? They've been here for years, and they're not to blame. They belong here. Hmm. She's gone again. Hiding in a bush, no doubt. <laughs> I wonder if she'll ever tell me something I can actually understand. That's a good question. <clears throat> the water is black. Ah, yeah, you talk to me. Try to solve every suspect's challenge topic. Hmm. Don't forget to present profiles and clues to people who might be interested. Okay. Oh, and hurry up. It's cold in this boat. Fair enough. Let's try and get... Easy. So, you. I found these designs for a hmm. boggy costume. Oh, some ridiculous new merchandise for tourists to waste their money on. No. Not really. I believe the murderer was dressed like this last night <laughs> when they attacked Remington. They were trying to scare him out of the swamp. They should have spent more time making an accurate design. What do you mean? Yeah. Well, this design <clears throat> is some bizarre <clears throat> hybrid between the real creature and the cartoon character. Oh, it simply okay. hasn't been researched properly. What's wrong with it? Well, those flippers? Pure guesswork. <laughs> Nothing but foolish imagination. Nobody knows <clears throat> what Boggy's feet look like. No footprint okay. has ever been recorded. <clears throat> so tell me, Special Agent Folder, how would you do a better job researching it if nothing has ever been recorded? Oh, that's well, a good question. That's, you know, I mean, it's all a matter of taking the time to... It's just that... But Shut there's up. no way anyone would believe nothing but foolishness. <laughs> no, everybody. Shut up! <laughs> hey, uh, I've never seen that before. Never want to see it again. Okay, fair enough. I think I know who I need, who I need to show the curtain piece to. Go to the treehouse. I'm. Yeah. Hi. Ooh. If you bring me something with liquid on it. Okay, you're not gonna be helpful with that, great. Okay. I thought maybe that she would recognize it, but no, okay. Go from here. Oh, this guy. Uh oh. You've arrived at a bad time, my friend. For oh. once, they don't actually want tourists walking around this place. <laughs> okay, I'm... fine. I always arrive at a bad time, that's I'm what I do. Detective, not a tourist. Huh. My apologies. <laughs> It's just, you have the same wide-eyed expression as the kids that come here. Running Thanks. around, spending their parents' money. You Oof. know, 
Mm, well, you know, it's not every day <laughs> I visit a swamp full of such interesting specimens. people. <laughs> it's no problem. You're just thinking what we all thought when we arrived for the first time. Why didn't they put in the bathroom? No, mm. you're thinking this place is beautiful. What a lucky no. man I am to be here. Not even close. I am, am I? Well, if you say so. Edward <coughs> Everstone, at your service. That's Why a pretty cool Echo? name. Can I call you Ed? You don't need to. Everyone just calls me Echo. Okay. I guess it gives you the sense, elevated sense of purpose point because you're a good swimmer. You bounce if I threw you off a wall. <laughs> Why? Because you'd As you bounce, bounce if I threw, if I threw you, against, you a against a wall? What? No. Because I always come back. Again and again. <coughs> until <coughs> my job <coughs> is done. <coughs> What do you tell me about these designs for a costume? A boggy costume? It's boggy! I must admit, I've been a fan of his before I ever came to the swamp. Hmm. A fan? So you're interested in cryptozoology? Oh, no, I meant, well, Boggy has been in all kinds of comics like and you? comic strips. He's one of the greatest characters of the last hmm. 100 years. I've got some comics in my tent. You really should see. He was only discovered 60 years ago. Oh, hmm. that's true. <laughs> Well, I bound it up. But what about this costume? Huh. Have you seen anyone wearing it? I <laughs> can honestly say I've never seen anyone wearing anything like that. And okay. I'm a very observant <clears throat> person. <clears throat> and a clue, maybe? You come yeah. here every day. Yes, I do. Well, I'm only going to ask you okay. about one of those days. What were you doing yesterday evening? I was here at my protest spot until fairly late. Mm -hmm. Then I went to get something to eat at Harper's Cafe before I... Wait, you ate at the cafe here? Yeah. Doesn't supporting the tourist attraction like that kind of go against your protest? A man has to uh, eat, doesn't he? Uh. I don't think the meager contributions <coughs> of one person are going to keep this place afloat. Especially That's not wrong. Now. And you're sleeping here? Doesn't it get cold at night? Well, I came That's, prepared, of yeah. course. I usually find myself with one or two extra layers to wear. Most mm. of this bulk is padding, I promise you. I'm sure okay. it is. So, you stayed here the whole night? That's yeah. right. And I admit, I may have heard some stranger than usual sounds floating around the swamp last mm. night. What kind of sounds? It's impossible to say. This place fills with the most terrifying sounds at night. Hundreds of animals, some tiny, some much larger, awaken mm -hmm. and make their own protests. Every night until okay. the sun rises in the morning. Insects make noises at night. Okay, I've written it down. Okay. Uh, what is his Your job? Protest, Clearly he's right? a protester. I certainly am. And now that you're here, I'm getting you involved. What is that? No. Yeah, I haven't got time to hold up signs for you. I'm sorry. You simply have to hear my message and take it with okay. you. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm good. I'm all ears. Fine. I have a little notebook. What was <laughs> the first thing you felt when you saw the sign for Boggy's Bog looming over you? Well, I thought it was... I thought. Felt. I felt... Well, something <laughs> seemed wrong. There wouldn't yes. be a tourist attraction in the middle of a swamp like this. That's there shouldn't true. be. Yeah. <laughs> My job is done. Clearly, your brain is working perfectly, Detective. Okay. So okay. you're against the tourist attraction? Yeah. Let's see. You'd rather this area was kept as a natural habitat, right? Right mm. again. And that precise word, habitat. First and okay. foremost, I'm protesting for animal rights. All right. Well, okay, I'm following you, but it's not like they're cutting down trees or anything like that, right? Yeah. All animals deserve the right to live in peace, and I promise you, on a normal day, this place is far from peaceful. Are you talking okay. about the swamp creature? About Boggy? A creature like that. He's earned the right to be left alone. We're hmm. fools to invite ourselves into his home like this on a daily basis, assuming okay. he's not going to mind. Assuming he'll keep to himself and let us walk around with his face on our t-shirts. Well, mm -hmm. I agree. I, mean, it's a little I bit, think he uh, should be left alone. Crazy. But like you said, he can probably handle himself. Yeah. If no one has even seen him in 60 years, I don't really see the problem. Unlike mm. you, Detective, I never had an academic calling in life. 
I was never okay. even a talented artist or musician or anything. Ah. So instead, I made the decision to stand up for those who were getting a raw deal. Okay. Pretty sure he's the guy that made the costume, but beyond that, I don't know. That said, though, everybody, I'm all out of time. I gotta go get ready for work today. If you enjoyed this one, make sure to like button. Remember, this is the final part of this series if you guys don't tell me you want to see more. So, I would love to play more for this, more of this for you guys, but you gotta, just gotta tell me that. This is really fun. These are all really cool characters, and they're fun to hang out with and stuff like that. And I like talking to them and figuring out what's going on with their heads and stuff. This is actually really interesting. Can't wait to see where this goes. But you guys have got to tell me you want to see it before I play more. So remember, guys, ring that bell. Catch you guys in the next video. Maybe the next game. I don't know. Let me know in the description. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Description below. The description below has the Discord channel. I will be okay. Don't worry. I'm not crazy. I'm just a little under caffeinated. Alrighty. See you guys later. Bye. Let me know if you want to see more. I want to play more. Please tell me you want to see more.